Welcome back everyone. I'll go ahead and show you exactly how to screen or record on your OnePlus 8 or OnePlus 8 Pro. Now the process could theoretically be the same for a lot of other Android phones out there. This is running Android 10 so it'll probably work on really any other Android 10 device, maybe even Android 9. But the process is very easy. As long as you have a OnePlus 8 that's charged for the most part then you're set or OnePlus 8 Pro will work the same. So all you want to do is basically go up to your status bar which is right here, scroll down, then you'll come into a page like this and you'll see the wide Wi-Fi Bluetooth toggles up here. All you want to do is scroll down once more and then you'll see a bunch of different toggles. Now what you want to do is find the toggle that says screen record. Okay, so as you can see it doesn't say screen record on my main thing right here. However, if you swipe through onto the next page you'll see right up the top on the top right corner there's a screen recording option. So you can go ahead and just click this and I'll go ahead and show you. You'll go ahead and get this little thing. You'll, you can just click always agree. And as you can see, you have this little thing right here that I'll go ahead and enable. So you can go and click it. And as you can see, it's starting to record. And that's really pretty much the process. As you can see, it's recording. I can do whatever I want to. And once you're ready to end it, you can tap here, click that stop button. And then as you can see, it'll say video saved to gallery. We can go and tap that. And I'll go ahead and save it straight onto the device. And as you can see, this is the screen record I just did. And it pretty much saved for the most part, which is really cool. Now, for some reason, it's not. Oh, there we go. Now, a common problem that I have seen before, I'll go ahead and exit out of it is that some people will say, oh, well, I scroll, or scrolled out and I couldn't find that screen recording option. And I don't even know why that screencast thing just came. But if you don't see that option, what you want to do is if you see that little pencil icon right here, you want to go ahead and click it. You'll come to a page like this and you want to look at this very bottom segment right here. If you do see that screen recording option, as you can see that it looks like that. If it's down here, you want to go ahead and just drag it basically like here and you want to drag it up and then you'll be able to finally screen record and go through all that. So if you don't see the screen recording option up here, maybe you know it didn't come stock, maybe they changed it in an update that it doesn't come up there anymore, you can just click that pencil and drag it from here up to there and screen record that way. So that's really pretty much the process. Again, all your photos and videos, for some reason I'm working more, there we go. All your photos and videos or whatever you screen record will be saved in your gallery app. So if you go down here, you'll find the gallery app somewhere, which is right here. It looks a little bit different. You want to go and tap it. And apparently you'll sometimes see it, I guess not. Or you have to click collections down here. And then you'll see the little all photos and videos. And then you'll see the little things that you just screen recorded. So that's really pretty much it. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much. But definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count. So me so much if you guys get hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my second channel. All those links are linked down below. I'd really appreciate it if you guys would check it out. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.